Hi, I'm Divyang Thakkar. I'm an actor and a Whistling Moods International alumni. My most memorable experience uh, was from a recent Gujarati film I did called Be Yaar. And uh, there was this scene in the climax which he wanted uh, to take in a single shot. Uh, he wanted the entire four and a half minute scene to be performed like that. That took me back to my uh, film school days when we used to uh, do this entire three minute mise-en scene, single shot. And all the departments needed to come together, the camera department, sound, production design, actors hitting their marks. So everyone had to come together and deliver that perfect take. So, you know, that kind of prepared me for that scene and I was able to, uh, you know, kind of uh, bring back my experience and put it to use in that scene. So, it was extremely fulfilling performing that scene. When I got to do professional stage when I was 16, uh, it just, you know, I, I found my calling. I finally found my calling and it's, it's a medium where you get to explore a lot. You know, the rehearsal process is really intensive. You get to work on a character. But what you get to know is it, it becomes a kind of a training ground. It becomes a kind of a rehearse for the uh, actors where uh, you can judge from the pulse of the audience and the reactions that they're giving you as to, you know, where you're heading with your performance. And you try out different things. You fail sometimes. Sometimes you, you hit the mark. But, you know, it gives you a lot of exercise as an actor and I feel it's a completely, it's completely an actor's medium. I think another difference in theatre and film is uh, the linearity, the way, in, the manner in which you perform a particular character. Films, uh, you perform say, uh, scenes in different, uh, you know, across the script uh, as per the scheduling. That kind of prepares you that when you actually do a film and you're doing a scene, picking a scene directly from the climax on the first day, where do you hit that, you know, what mark do you, uh, at, at what emotional level do you pitch that scene? So I think uh, both mediums excite me at, at different levels and I, I, I love performing uh, for both mediums. I'll, I'll never be able to give one up, so yeah. I think what excited me the most about uh, the program at Whistling Woods was that it was two years uh, with, with other short-term courses. Um, I think what I learned at Whistling Woods, uh, I wanted to, you know, kind of imbibe within myself. I want to practice within an environment where I'm supervised by uh, by teachers and everyone around, and I'm able to implement the same things which I've learned in classroom on projects. So student projects which the other directors used to do, and uh, that helped me. Uh, put into practice whatever that I learnt in class on, on the, the very same day. So, uh, and also, apart from acting classes, we learnt uh, various things which were, uh, you know, like voice modulation, diction, dancing, we had uh, dubbing classes, we had a whole lot of everything that an actor um, needs to know uh, for his craft was taught at Whistling Woods. So I think uh, that is what I appreciate in this two-year programme. I just want to say, uh, work on yourself. I think training, any kind of training, whether it is on uh, stage, theatre or going to a film school, takes into account that keep adding things to your skill set, whether it's singing or dancing. You know, actors like Ayushman Khurana and Alia Bhatt, you know, they are singing their own songs. So, you know, that, that becomes an asset, a voiceovers, you know. Uh, so, try to get different kind of work because if you're, if, you're, if you're stuck with that mindset that I only want a certain kind of work, then that may not come to you, but if you keep working, if you keep working on yourself and keep doing the kind of work, uh, you know, different kinds of work, uh, uh, you know, which are all, I think, an extension of you as an actor, I think you'll get better at things. You just keep working your instrument, that is your body well and developing it and, you know, you're always prepared for that one role to come to you and, and, and uh, whatever it demands, you're able to give at that point of time.